Alrighty, so today I'm going to be showing you um, the MOSFET. So here is the MOSFET. It's not a retail MOSFET, it's a self made MOSFET. It's wired to Dean's on a gun with a stripped piston and running just a K to Bay motor for now. The battery I'll be putting in here is a Hobby People 25C. Uh, it's a little bit ripped off, but uh, it is 25C. It's 11.1 volt, 2,500 milliamps, and a 25C. All right, so let's plug this in. Okay, if you guys are interested, the way I arrange this MOSFET is put this right on top of the battery pouch so it doesn't get shot off and just close the flap and connect these two. Alright now before I begin my gun has no semi as you can see here my selector, uh, uh, my selector switch will move to semi but will not move to full auto. It, it gets stuck inside I have a aftermarket selector plate which um, doesn't really fit well in this GNG gun. It's not really GNG anymore, it's not stock, but yeah, so basically no semi, and I'll be showing you a monster stress test. Alright, so that is a 25C battery, and the wiring is not hot at all. The MOSFET is not warm at all. The motor is uh, heating up a little bit, but that's to be expected. It's a, it's a stock KDB motor. Um, my piston is stripped right now, and my bushings are cracked, so I can't do anything about that, but yeah. Yeah, the MOSFET works really well, as I said before. There is no heating in the Deans whatsoever. The MOSFET itself is not heated at all. And the gun is still working.